Prayer for the month of July. May peace be with us. July invites us to contemplate the precious blood of our Lord Jesus Christ, shed for us for the remission of our sins. In this month, let us raise our prayers to the Lord, begging for His divine mercy, flooding our days with His love, His glory, and His blessings. Let us begin this blessed period with the sign of the cross. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for the seventh month of 2024. July is radiant and promising, an opportune moment for reflection. As I realize that more than half the year has passed, I acknowledge with deep gratitude your constant goodness and mercy that has guided my steps in the previous months. Today, before I beg for your blessings and graces, I first want to praise you. I want to thank you for your inexhaustible goodness. The Word teaches us to always rejoice in you, and it is in this spirit that I begin this day. I praise you and thank you for your constant protection, Lord. In the midst of the challenges I have faced, I recognize that your hand has kept me from physical and spiritual harm. In you I find security and fulfillment of your promises. To you be all the glory and praise, my God. Lord, in my journey with you, I recognize your faithfulness, which has been like a beacon in the midst of life's storms. I love you with all my being, because in every challenge, you have preserved my soul from the spiritual damage that threatens my path. The devil sometimes tries to lead me astray with his traps, and I face temptations that seem insurmountable. In moments of mental exhaustion, loneliness, and sadness, I find solace in the certainty of your protective presence by my side. You are my shepherd and I, your sheep, depend daily on your mercy and grace to find comfort. While the enemy seeks to destroy, I know that it is you, Lord, who guards my life and sustains me. In the midst of setbacks and anxieties, I trust that your presence will sustain me as I enter this new month. I thank you for being my provider, strengthening me when I feel weak and providing in times of need. When difficulties arise, I recognize your divine providence. In humility, I surrender my sorrows and burdens this month to you. I especially ask for forgiveness for my past sins, for moments of mistrust, for causing pain to others, and for not having done as much good as I could. Purify my heart, Lord, and grant me a spirit of humility to face the challenges ahead. Guide me, bless me, and help me to overcome my weaknesses so that I can walk according to your will. Lord, in this new month of July, I come to you with humility, seeking your ever stronger presence in my life. I recognize that your power is unlimited in this vast universe, and I pray that you overflow this month with your heavenly blessings. May my body, mind, and spirit be blessed by your infinite grace and power. In particular, may my path be illuminated by your divine light. May I, with faith, follow your teachings and purposes for my life. Lord, at this time, I express my intentions with trust in your sovereign will. Thank you for blessing this month with your constant presence and unconditional love. During this July, I ask you, Lord, to watch over my health and physical well-being. May my body be kept as your holy temple, enabling my hands and legs to carry out your works. May my mouth be used to praise your name, and may my heart overflow with love for you and for my fellow human beings. I recognize the difficulties and temptations of this life, the distractions that can take me away from you. Help me to love you sincerely and to praise you like the holy figures of our faith. Bless my resources, Lord, and provide daily sustenance for me and my family. In times of economic challenges, such as high oil, gas, and food prices, I trust in your providence and ask for your guidance. May this month be marked not only by your material provision, but also by your renewing spiritual presence in my life. Enable me, Lord, to face each day with faith, hope, and gratitude for your infinite goodness. Lord, before you, I recognize that nothing is hidden, 
I ask you to help us manage all our responsibilities. Guide us to focus more on you and less on money, because we know that where our treasure is, there our heart will be too. Lord, bless my family in all its needs. Take care of each member, from my children to my brothers, sisters, uncles, aunts, and all those who sincerely love you. I beg you for pure hearts and minds, free from sin and committed to your holy will. Grant us, Lord, the necessary provisions in this new month of July, not only material but also spiritual, so that we can grow in your grace. Finally, I surrender my intentions to you, Lord, knowing that you know what is best for me. If it is your will, fulfill the desires of my heart, for I trust in your wisdom that transcends my limited understanding. You know the future and are in control of all things. In you I place my full trust. Bless my life, Lord, and grant me peace. I praise you for your constant goodness and mercy. I believe you will bless me this coming month. I am ready and excited to live each day with you by my side. In closing, we recall the words of the Apostle Paul to the Corinthians about the celebration of the Lord's Supper, which reminds us of the sacrifice of Jesus Christ until he comes again. Lord, your word warns us of the seriousness of participating in the Lord's Supper in a dignified manner, aware of the sacredness of the bread and cup that represent your body and blood. Before approaching, we must examine our hearts and confess any sin, seeking your mercy and forgiveness. Let us pray together. Remembering your great sacrifice, Lord, I ask your forgiveness for my sins and iniquities. As this year progresses, I recognize my continued need for your grace and forgiveness. I wish to sincerely confess my sins, seeking your cleansing. Bless my life and my family, enabling us to love and serve you with dedication. When we gather to eat, may we be reminded that you are the true bread of life, sustenance and source of eternal life. Bless this month of July with your goodness and guidance, enabling me to carry out your will with a sincere and faithful heart. Amen. Finally, I offer this poem to our Lord Jesus for this month of July. Jesus, as we enter the embrace of July, I come humbly before you with gratitude in my heart for the hot summer days and the beauty of nature that enchants us. I thank you for the gift of life you have given me, for the blessings of family and friends, for your infinite love that fills my soul with hope and light and guides me through the dark nights while the sun shines on earth. May divine love and grace envelop us with joy, guiding us along the road of life as we seek to follow your designs on a daily basis. Grant me, O Lord, the strength I need to face the challenges that lie ahead. May faith always accompany us, dispelling all fear and apprehension. And when darkness and uncertainty obscure my path, may your gentle hands wipe away my tears and lead me to the light. May this month of July be a time of peace and serenity, an opportunity to seek your guidance and be eternally blessed by your love that floods our hearts, overflowing as we raise our hands in prayer, expressing our love for Jesus. Hear my prayer. May your love always remain in me, being my hope and my rock, guiding me on this journey until I return to dust. May God bless all of us and our families in this new month. Amen. For nine consecutive days, it is recommended that this prayer be recited daily. Share it with those who can benefit from it and sign up to receive new inspiring prayers. Don't forget to activate notifications so that you're always up to date with the latest news. Thank you for following this July prayer and may God enlighten your path.